What exactly is Conquering the Beast Ministries? Well, Life with Purpose Radio's Juliana Smoke brings us the inside story. Scott Mendez is a world champion bull rider and founder of Western Harvest Ministry, where he uses bull riding as a tool to share Christ with others. Scott Mendez, founder of Western Harvest Ministry, joins us today on Life with Purpose Radio. Hello, Scott. Hello. Now, Scott, God used bull riding as a way of a wake-up call for you to surrender your life to Christ. Yes, He sure did. I've had an exciting career riding bulls, and the Lord just really was trying to get my attention. And In 1994, I was at my third national finals rodeo in Las Vegas. The way it worked out that day, my best friend was riding a bull. He rode about six seconds, and the bull bucked him off right in front of my chute where I was getting ready to ride. And tragically, the bull jumped in the air and stepped on my friend Mm. and instantly killed him in the arena. And I saw that, Mm. and all the fundamental things that my grandmother and mother had taught me about the Word of God just really flashed before my eyes. And Mm. so it changed my heart, and it changed my walk with God to think about how close it was that it could have been me but that I had been granted through grace and sovereignty another chance, and I began to live for Christ and walk with Him. Everything drastically changed in my life. Amen. Isn't that amazing when God starts to draw your heart to Him, and you just surrender your life to Christ? And and then He started drawing you into the ministry. How did He lead you to begin this ministry? You know, the Bible says in Psalms 37, 4, Delight yourself in the Lord, and He'll give you the desires of your heart. I was striving to obtain worldly accomplishments. I really was defeated and deceived in thinking that I had to be a world champion in order to show people who Christ was in my life, and it was just the opposite. The Lord said, I need you before the championship. And so instantly I felt that if and should the Lord give me that opportunity, that I was committed and sold to Him to be able to use that for Him. And once I made that commitment, life again would change Mm. because He had a plan and a purpose, and I walked into my destiny when I committed to Him. So my purpose is not what I do. It is who I am in Christ Jesus. How are you able to use bull riding as a tool to share Christ with others? Well, there's a lot of young people that are trying to be where we are at the very elite top of our industry. And so God has blessed us through our Conquer and the Beast training camp. What we do is we train them in a camp, and then we provide a place of competition for them. It's really trying to disciple and raise up godly young men in the arena. And you also host rodeo events as well. Yes, uh, we have a two-hour program in our Conquer and the Beast Crusades. We go in, we put on a rodeo, and we do some free workshops during the day, but we kind of grant finale to the Saturday evening performance. It is a professional bull riding. We have speakers that are relative to the youth in the community. It's really a family-friendly event, and we have a wonderful time. For example, we would go into a small Texas community. We'd have over 3,000 people, and then we would see as many as 300 people come to know the Lord through a rodeo event. Wow. Wow, that's amazing. Now, Scott, you've come from a very long line of cowboys, and it seems just to be in your blood to ride bulls. Did you ever imagine that God would take your gifts and talents to lead people to Christ? You know, it's been an amazing journey. I got on my first calf at around five or six years old. Since then, I've rode in three or four different countries. I've rode in Madison Square Gardens, but I had no idea that he wanted to or could use my life to impact others. How can we get more information on Western Harvest Ministry? You could go to Western Harvest Ministries and learn all about our outreaches and even some of our media work there as well. We've been speaking with Scott Mendez, founder of Western Harvest Ministry. What a pleasure to have you with us today and remind us that God wants to use all of our gifts and talents for His glory. You're exactly right, Juliana. Just like these bulls we ride in the arena that are raging out of control and trying to buck us off, I know sometimes people get bucked off in life and you just have to get back on. And no matter what your calling is or where you're at today, Trust God with all your heart. Lean not onto your own understanding, and He will direct your path. So I encourage you to maybe conquer the beast in your life that's been holding you back from God's very best for your purpose to be fulfilled. For Life with Purpose Radio, I'm Juliana Smoke.